the standard history used to be that the um, modern day pit bull or bull or bulldog uh, was actually a cross between the um, old, old time bulldog and uh, uh, a terrier that was now extinct, white terrier. The old theory was that, that the um, bulldog added gameness to the terrier and the terrier added agility to the bulldog. In the process of researching the breed's history, I began to question that because everybody was copying everybody else, even back in the 19th century in regard to that history. And I think that that history was actually the history of the show bull terrier and not of our dog. Because if you go back and look at the artwork 400 years ago, the dogs look just like they do now, doing the same type of things they do now. So what would be the reason for the cross? There's no reason for it. It would make them less game. <coughs> they were, had to be funny agile for the things they were doing. So over the course of years, we have paintings and, and, and um, writings about them being used for hunting and boar hunting, and they're still used in boar hunting today. And um, they were used as a butcher's dog for catching rough stock like bulls and stuff like that so the butcher could dispatch the bull with a hammer or something, with a big hammer, mallet. And, um, and, and, and they still use them as, as stock dogs today for rough terrain where they can't get a rope on the stock. So these are things that the dogs have done throughout their history that they're still being used for today. The thing that I think happened is some of the real short muzzled dogs started being kept as pets because they liked that short nose. Made them look, look more exotic, more human. And so those were, I think, descendants of our dogs that were just sort of deformed a little bit. And I think that's what they crossed with the white terrier to make the bull terrier. And you can almost see it as you go through the pictures in the past, where it looked more like these dogs and got more and more to where it looks like it does today. And um, the bull terrier would be, I think, rightly called a cross between that type of bulldog with a terrier. And, and so it created that breed too. I, I, I would make the case that um, the American Pit Bull Terrier is the original Bulldog, and the Show Bulldog is an uh, offshoot from the original Bulldog that's bred for appearance more than anything else.